Now let us use 3D object replication in this tutorial right here. So I have my element 3D and what I'm going to do is I'm going to go into scene setup. So now um, uh, we have to select two models, one to be used as a replicator shape and one as a particle shape. So I'm going to go over here into my starter pack and let's say I want to use uh, this shape right here, the light bulb as the particle. So I'm going to leave that as it is. So I'm going to create a primitive shape over here, uh, which I'm going to use as a 3D object for replication. So I'm going to go over here into something like this donut. All right. So I just chose this donut and this is what I want to use as the replicator shape. So I'm going to bring this out of the group folder. And uh, if I do that, you can see that now I can select the group option leave the group to group one itself but go on to the right hand side over here you can see that there's this little icon and once you click on this you can see that now the icon changes and now it converts into a replicator shape so now you can see that this is the replicator shape so you can go over shader and go to point and you can see that this is how the shape is going to be replicated as you can see, all the points, as you can see here, will be used as points to keep the bulb on as we chose. So I'm going to go into shade it. I'm going just going to press OK now so that the bulb appears. So I'm going to go into group one, I'm going to go into particle replicator and I'm going to uh, resize this. I'm going to go into particle look and resize the bulb shape first. So now what I'm going to do is going to go into the 3D object. So it takes the donut as the object replication shape and you can see that um, the donut shape actually takes place let me just use the camera to show you around so i'm going to create a new camera press ok and i'm going to rotate this around so i'm going to rotate orbit the camera around and you can see that the donut shape actually appears so i can go over here into our in shape right here let me just go over here into group and increase the 3d object percentage and right now you can see that the number of object is not there anymore uh, the percentage actually comes up that is uh, it calculates the number of points and uh, allows you to select the percentage of how many points you want to use so if i were to say 100 percent you can see that everything is being selected right off the bat so i can go over here and rotate it around and you can see that the donut shape actually takes place you can all go over here change the particle size over here and you can see that now all of the points are being used as a reference, I can go over here into the camera, rotate it around and particle shape is being used. So you can see that this is how you can use a shape and use a shape uh, for 3D object replication. So hope you guys learned something as always. And as always, please like, comment, share and subscribe.